school's done, then you're then it's all these decisions to make. What what do you want to do with your the rest of your life? You know, they always push that on you when you're in like eighth grade or whatnot, or even seventh grade. So what do you want to do when you get older? That's like, well, I never really thought about it. You know, I mean, there's so much to choose from, but I want to make sure if I, for whatever I choose, that it's at least something that I enjoy. I was never the popular kid in school. You know, maybe I would be now because I do the video thing and all that, and I'm po I'm kind of popular around the people that have watched my videos at least uh, that I know at my job or. Or, you know, even around the area, you know, there's people that actually watch my videos, you know, that that are pretty, that actually like what they see, that I know, and uh, that, uh, you know, find it kind of interesting the fact that I would want to do something like this, you know, with my daily life and, you know, whatever. But I told him, I said, you know, it's just something I've always wanted to do, you know, and the fact to be able to make a video so easily through this little webcam here. Uh, you know, it's it's pretty pretty amazing. Uh, no, I was never the popular kid in school because I didn't really get involved with much, and that was my problem. I always quit. I quit too soon, and I you know, eventually in my life as I got older, I decided quitting was not quitting was not really the greatest idea, because if you quit everything you ever wanted to accomplish, then what do you have? What can you say you've accomplished? Now, with being in radio and all that, like I was. And like I still am here and there, uh, you know, I, I got the opportunity to, to talk to a lot of people. Like, I interviewed a lot of people, like, not just regular Joes off the street. I'm talking celebrities. I wish I would have been doing this YouTube thing, especially when I was doing the radio thing full time, when I was there at the studio so much. And, and I wish you guys could have been a part of that, you know, some of the studio, live studio things that we did. And we were even broadcast on stickcam.com a few times. And, and uh, I think if I would have done more through the YouTube thing, and it, I would have been doing this then, I think, uh, well, I think a lot of people would take more interest in what I'm doing. You know, I look at the comments that I get on my, my channel, I'm not getting that many comments here and there that I thought. It's always the same people that are looking at myself, and, and other people that I view, I wish everybody would leave a comment. Because it's like, you know, everybody seems to, it seems to be that you need to have a whole lot of subscribers in order to get a lot of feedback, but... But whatever, I mean, at least I'm getting the views and everything. That's why I'm do continuing to do the vlog like I am. Because I find it... I find that it's something that it, that I should be doing. You know, more or less. But anyway, so with high school memories, that's pretty much all I can say. And I chose my senior year just because of the fact that I, I felt that was more the year that was made more of an impact in my life. That, and that pretty much did. And now, as I mentioned in yesterday's video, that we're going to play a little tag game. Now, some of the people that I know that watch my video, I, I'm going to choose somebody uh, to make a video response to this video. Or even, 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 even it could be a video response, or it could be like something like, uh, oh, I don't know. Something that's either a video response or something where you can just uh, respond back in a way where we can uh, have a little fun with this. And make a video of your own, talk about your own high school memories, whether they were great memories or not. And then also tag in somebody else that you'd like to see, that you know watches your videos. And can, can see how long we can keep this going and see how many people will actually do this. So the person that I am officially tagging is not other than Wet Movie one because I know he's been watching a lot of my videos on a daily basis. And I'm going to tag you, Brendan, and let's see what you can come up with. So I'm Frankie Sloss, and we'll see you tomorrow for another great daily summer vlog.